That sound means it is time to verify. Wedding bells have not been ringing as much these days. The COVID pandemic has turned the wedding industry upside down and left so many couples with a big bouquet of unknowns on their special day. Good morning show viewer Jerry emailed me saying he read my report from last summer on wedding reception restrictions. He said his daughter got married in a small private ceremony last March and is holding a reception this March inside. He wanted to know the current rules in Charlotte. That's a great question, Jerry, and it really applies to everyone in North Carolina, Charlotte to Greensboro and beyond because the answer is a statewide rule. My sources for this are Governor Roy Cooper's executive orders, specifically 195 and 169. Also, State Health Department Rep Katie Armstrong and Triad Wedding Coordinator Brittany Botts. It's been really difficult to try to figure out how do we have a ceremony that's not capped. We invite everyone and everyone's welcome and then try to push away people and say without being rude. Yeah, Bots owns a touch of Southern wedding planning. She notes what we've previously reported that none of the executive order of orders can cap wedding ceremonies because religious gatherings have First Amendment protections. Receptions do not. So initially receptions fell under the original stay home orders mass gathering limits and then phase three and the extended stay home order allowed larger receptions of 30% stated fire capacity up to 100 people. But the governor's newest executive order issued yesterday, which takes effect tomorrow night, will expand that capacity. Outdoor receptions can have 30% capacity or seven guests per 1000 square feet. Indoor receptions can have 30% capacity up to 250 people in one confined room or space, but guests must still stay seated except to get food or use the restroom. Health Department Representative Katie Armstrong explained in part quote facilities should avoid scheduling a standing reception or cocktail hour. Wedding ceremonies, as we've noted, are not subject to the capacity and other requirements, but guests are encouraged to follow the three W's. So is it true viewer Jerry's daughter can have a wedding reception in March? Yes, if it is in line with capacity rules. And remember the new executive order allowing 250 guests takes effect tomorrow night at 5. So any reception scheduled for tonight is still capped at 100 people. If you have a verifying inquiry, submit a post screenshot or selfie video to my Facebook page, Megan Malaris News, or email or tweet me and let me get your questions verified.